picking up the Jayco. Be the first uh, 24 trip this year. Do some winter camping. Got her all hooked up. Got to take the chalk blocks out. And then we're headed out. Excited. Over here, local nursery store. Got the propane tanks all topped off. $5.99 a gallon this year. It went up a dollar. It was $4.99 a gallon. But excited our last uh, seven day trip. Powering the refrigerator and running the heat uh, off of propane. We only used 4.5 gallons, which is about half of one of these tanks. So we didn't even touch this tank over here. This tank right here, a full week, half the tank. So very pleased with that. Very pleased. Hey, you think the you think the generator is gonna start Gucci? It's been sitting all winter. Let's give her a go. Let's power on. Let's turn the fuel on and <laughs> what do you think, Gooch? Yeah. One of the things I like about the 199 MBS uh, on the J Feather Micro Series is that you can run the 12 volt refrigerator um, off electricity. And if you're off the grid, no electricity, you can run it off of propane. It's sitting all winter, and the pilot light's already on, ignited, and the refrigerator's on, propane. Happy, happy, happy. Well, we just passed the Florence Correctional Complex. I thought it was a Supermax, but this is some nasty weather. We're still heading south. Stealth camping in Colorado, out here. Oh my, the snowstorm that we came through outside of Florence, we just had to turn around and decided to come back here and stealth camp at this Love's truck shop. Truck stop, truck shop. So this is stealth camping right here for free. You two, what are you doing? Nice and warm in here. Whew. Right now, temperature in here is 66 degrees. Things so up here, real muddy and messy out there. But getting settled in. Don't have water turned on. Still very cold outside. So bathroom is the pantry slash closet. So got the bed made over here. This is where Gucci and I go to sleep at night. Gucci, Gucci hangs out down there in the daytime. Isn't that right, Gucci? Gucci. Isn't that right? Mm -hmm. So John got this little trash can. It's kind of neat. It hangs out here on the outside of this door right here. Uh, under the sink and little trash bags go in there. It's kind of neat. Come down here and open this up and you went out of a trash bag. Look, there's your other trash bag. Pull out and put in there. It's a nice little find from my wife. Excellent. Other than that, getting all set in the 199 MBS Jayco. Good night. Well, Gucci did her business outside, so she got a chicken jerky tender. Aren't you spoiled, young lady? Now, get her some of her pumpkin dog food. Mm hmm. And there you go, Gucci. Gucci bubble. There you go. You have some water now. So. Anything else that you need? Is there? Okay. I love you too. All right. We're settled in the bed and it is snowing like crazy outside, but yeah, you said it right. Good night. Good morning to you. Yeah. Let's see how much snow we got this morning. We got a lot of snow. It's okay. Oh wow. Cannon City, Colorado. Man. The 
cows are here to visit us. Well, this is the end of the road for us today. We are stuck here. Tires are sliding. So we got on the side of the road here. What an adventure. I think it's Sand Gulch, about 15, 20 miles north of Kansas City. Beautiful out here though. Look at the cows. They're curious. All right, I'm gonna get Gucci out of the truck. We're gonna set up shop here. Isn't that right, Gucci? Yeah. Come hey there, buddy. Yeah, don't worry about Gucci. She's just saying hello. You guys looking for some grass to chew on? Sorry, but I'm not sharing any of my grass with you guys. Sorry, not happening. Have a good one. Goodbye. You're on some BLM property. Gucci making some yellow snow over there. BLM stands for Bureau of Land Management. And right over there where you see that little post, or right beside to the left of that, is where the camp post is supposed to be. And we happenstance to come across a ghost campground. Imagine that. There's nobody here. And we have it all to ourselves. Out here. You like the snow, Gucci? Yeah. I only want to leave you on the snow for a couple minutes, though. I don't want your paws to freeze. So if you look to your left here, you'll see the camp host. I can't see anything, but maybe you will. This is where the camp host is. And we almost made it here. Guess what? This view is spectacular. Million dollar view with the snow. And Gucci sniffing the rock. Cleared out a spot right here for the generator. Gucci thinks it's a game, of course. It's still lightly snowing a bit. Use a little chimney and tarp whatever made a shelter here for the generator uh, just to ensure we're not getting that much sun I do have solar 200 watts uh, it, it is showing that it's charging inside just from that but it's peeking in and out from the weather but, uh, we'll let this run until the gas runs up some more gas in there we have enough uh, heat tonight so Us and it will suck all the air out. So, well, that's heating up. Good old sausage links for breakfast. sausage was really good but now we got a we're trying this for the first time some biscuit 
shake and pour. All we had to do was add water. We had no measuring device, so Eric added a little and a little and a little. All the shenanigans. Here we go. Oh yeah, that is not round folks, that's Australia. Okay, it's time to make some instant coffee. Put some water in here. Put a little bit on right here. I don't know if Gucci gave Eric a workout or if Eric gave Gucci a workout. What's up? We had this guy come help us get unstuck and he's gonna put us in a really good spot. This guy's back there on the vehicle help us get out. Thankful we got this done before dark. Right? Camping in a winter wonderland. Finally, in our final resting spot, Eric is pulling the tundra around right now to back it up right in front of the Jayco. Really thankful for this guy. His name's Dave, too. When Dave's not there, man, there's another Dave. situated and it's time to eat some spicy pork. Marinated, got the idea from Outdoor Boys, vacuum seal, have it marinated all ready to go once you get it, it makes it a lot easier. South Korean favorite of mine. And a lot of people, a lot of people, it's quite important. Spicy pork is good. So 
some uh, bean paste here. Cucumber kimchi, some peppers, and some radish kimchi, sweet radish kimchi. That's three Korean away, giving me all these recipes and getting it all ready for me. Oh yeah. And then the microwave rice we got going on over there. 90 seconds in the microwave, some sticky rice. Saw the sun yesterday. Gucci Bubble, what are you doing? Come here. Come on. Come on. Oh, Gucci, Gucci. You ready for your protein? Ready for breakfast? Yeah, you get your boiled egg every day, don't you? Uh-huh. And look at you sitting there waiting so patiently. Yeah. Got protein from that egg. That much trick you need for the with your dog food. You so spoiled. You're so spoiled. Breakfast time. Kind of steep, isn't it, Gooch? What do you smell? Smell another doggy? Come on, come on. Lead the way, Scout. Good girl. Eric up there and Gucci. We're on an afternoon hike. There's the Jake.
Such a beautiful Saturday afternoon. Oh, I am not in shape. You will probably hear me breathing heavily. Oh, we hiked up the mountain, up to the cliff walls. This really helps my combat stress. This grounds me every single time. long day of hiking and going to the Royal Gorge and Skyline View in Kansas City. Sitting here enjoying a movie, Broken Arrow, from 1994, 1995, I believe. John Travolta and Christian Slater, is that right? Christian Slater? And we're going to have Franks and Beans for dinner. Franks and Beans! Have you seen my baseball? Uh, Franks and Beans! Franks and Beans!
some bacon this morning. Isn't that right, dudes? You smell that bacon? Do ya? <laughs> yeah, I smell it good. This is Shelf Road, about 15 miles north of Cannon City. The lovely temperature right now is 54 degrees with a slight wind coming from the north. Today we are being sponsored by pork and beans. Enough gas is never too much. Well, it's always that time when you gotta pack up and head home. So, get it all hooked up. Got the, the Jayco hooked up. The hitch right here, the bars, we're not gonna put on until we actually get out of the campground because some of these turns uh, coming out of here are pretty tight. So we'll take it pretty slow. So don't wreck the Jayco on one of these rocks, one of these limestone rocks. Right up there, in that little corner right there in the middle of the screen right there is where we hiked up to yesterday. Had a wonderful time, wonderful hike up there. Zan Gulch, Colorado, BLM, Bureau of Land Management. There's Eric. We had a wonderful time. We're out of here. Well, the Jayco is back in her stable. Give her a nice bath, pressure washer. <laughs> 